Good morning, guys. Say good morning. <laughs> Today is Saturday, and um, last night we, or I should say all day yesterday, I decided to do like a deep cleaning and like KonMari of Addison's bedroom. Like literally took every thing out of his room, brought it out into the living room, deep cleaned the room, put everything back in, and like sorted through all of his toys and clothes and just got rid of everything that he doesn't wear anymore or use anymore or he's too old for. Um, and stuff that we need to give away. If you guys are interested in seeing that, it's going to be up on my main channel. Um, so that took all day yesterday. I was cleaning all day yesterday. Um, so today, Scott is going to be taking all the pa posters out of his um, flat file that's in Addison's room and storing them in something else and like foam boards taking that flat file out into the shed and then we are going to go buy this one his first mattress so we're gonna start with just doing like a twin mattress on the floor just because he moves so much at night like we're just worried if we get like a bed frame he's just gonna like fall out of it um, like in the queen bed he's all over the place um, so if he like falls off of a mattress that's on the floor, he's gonna be like, you know, like not far. So it won't hurt him. So that'll help get him used to sleeping on his own, in his own bed. I think he's like trying to tell us that he's ready because he doesn't want us in there when he goes to sleep for nap time or bedtime now. He just says bye <laughs> and then he, he'll just lay on his pillow and go like right to bed on his own he doesn't want anyone around him um, before he used to need to be like cuddled to go to sleep but now like just the past like I want to say two weeks he's been doing that and I just feel like it's his way of telling us that he's ready to like be in his own bed and like be on his own and he's okay now um, which is perfect timing because this one is going to be here in about three months and I need to get the rest of the stuff out of the crib and get that whole little section of the bedroom uh, ready. Um, we need to bring the bassinet, if we have a halo bassinet, we need to bring that inside. Um, I mean, probably going to wait to do that for a little bit. Um, three months still. <laughs> but, um get ready for the baby to be in that room now because this baby's big this baby's big he's a big boy now um yeah so that's what's on the agenda today we're gonna go to the mattress store that's down the street from us um get him a mattress scott's gonna clean out the flat the posters and the flat file from the bedroom um i've got homework to do I'm hungry also um I think we're gonna go get breakfast burritos. They have a Mexican place that's next to the mattress store. And I wanna try their breakfast burritos, but they don't open until 10. And I think it's only like eight <laughs> and I'm hungry now. So I don't know if I can wait that long. Oh no, it's nine. Yeah, so that's what we're doing. I have homework and um, I need to finish going through this living room because there's still a bunch of stuff just like all over the place. And like all behind the couch over there is all the toys that we want to um, sell in the in the yard sale or donate or whatever. And then um, stuff that needs to be packaged for the shed, that's going to be for the baby. Um, but I mean, babies don't play with stuff until they're like at least six to nine months. So like none of that stuff we need anytime soon. So we're just going to store it in the shed for now. Um, and I just need to fold. There's like two loads of laundry I need to fold and I need to do the dishes I didn't do dishes at all yesterday because I was cleaning his bedroom the entire entire day so yeah that's what we're doing happy weekend dishes 
have been done. Coffee has been drunk. Ready for food and a mattress. Oh, clean kitchen. Hold on, buddy. <laughs> the chipper feeding and the foams, they're going to make a big harsh smell. Yeah, and it's not, not going to be yeah, good. We don't want that at all. So let's try medium here for baby, and then we can try firm as well, too, and see what's going on. I think it's going to be a medium. <laughs> where, now buddy? they're both individual Anything, come pocketed here. coils, so he can grow into it. Oh my god. Are you what dying? Are you doing? <laughs> don't breathe in the formaldehyde. See, he can be the baby on the Serta Pierce foam pad. <laughs> yeah. He's like, I'm just gonna take a nap, guys. Can you leave now? Yeah, I think we have a winner. <laughs> See, it's medium, not too soft, not too firm. Yeah. And it's being good comfort too. So it will yeah, come think, a little bit firmer than this as well. I think the firm might be too. Yeah, I like the medium. Like one. soft. So this one in the twin size, this one's on sale right now from six seventy nine. It's on sale for four seventy nine. That's mattress only on here. But keep in mind, we pay for your tax as well too. <laughs> but um, would you guys need? Our first night in our big boy bed. <gasps> Baby, he's so big. <sighs> We're so excited. right now uh we got his big boy bed we got him some sheets and then we just got this um right. like right. one of those like really soft what are they called blankets oh my god really um scott and i both have one of these that we sleep with they're just so soft and i thought it would be um more comfortable right. than a comforter because and he's used to sleeping with like these sorts of blankets from um, our bed and like just in the living room like I have these blankets all around the house um, for like just lounging around the, the, the couch or the love set the bed room everywhere we have these blankets are just so comfortable so we got him a twin size blanket some sheets Target happened to be having like a 30% off sheet sale so we got this sheet set for like I think it was like eight bucks like um, these are the pillows that he has claimed as his from our house. He just randomly just be forms an attachment with certain pillows in the house and he, they're his pillows. Like if you try to use it, he pulls it from behind your head and he takes it away from you. Um, so that has been his pillow. The love you more pillow has been his pillow for a while now. And he's just recently claimed these blue pillows off of the couch as his. So 
those are what he sleeps with and I just have this big body pillow that was um, in our bed against the wall so that he wouldn't like fall into the little crevice. Um, so I've been putting that against the wall so he doesn't like turn and like smack his head at night or something on the wall just to get him used to being in this sort of arrangement. He didn't fall off the bed at all. So he went to bed at around nine, a little later than usual because we were just late to put him to bed. Um, so he went to bed at nine. Um, we came in here, um, put him down. Well, you saw last um, in the vlog from yesterday. Um, I put him in bed. He went right to bed. He kept saying, night, 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 night. Night. <laughs> night, night. Night. <laughs> you are so cute. Night. Night. Night, night. Night. <laughs> night, night. Night. You cute baby. Um, I put his little sound machine on, went to bed like that, oh. all by himself in the bed. Um, no problem at all. Um, woke up then at 11.45, crying. I came in here, just, you know, told him, like, it's okay, you're in Addison's big boy room now. And I think he would just kept, it seemed like he was waking up just kind of like, where am I? We're not in this room a whole lot, like he plays in here sometimes. Um, but I think it's just like waking up and just like, where am I? type thing and used to waking up and being next to like me or Scott um yeah those are paints we can play with those later baby we don't get to play with paints in the house um and then okay so he woke up went right back to sleep as soon as I would come in and like just tell him everything was okay went right back to sleep within like a minute I went back to bed hour later he I'm sorry baby we don't get to play paints build mama block Build on the tower. He really wants to play with paints. He's hungry. Scott went to go get breakfast burritos right now. Show, mom, show how you build a tower so good. Can you build mom a tower? He's like, no, I want to play with water paint. He wants to go outside. Here he keeps saying, outside? Outside? And I'm like, it's too cold outside right now. Oh, Addison, it's okay. Come here. We can watercolor later, baby. Addison, come on. Come here, baby. It's gonna be okay. You're gonna be okay. Oh, we're better. Oh, we're better. That was fast. Who's this? Who's this? Dory. Dory. Dory makes everything better. Uh, so woke up at 11.45, went back to sleep, woke up at 12.45, went back to sleep, woke up at 1.30. 1.30? No, 2.30. I think he slept for like a little longer the third time. Ah! Um, but then that time he went back to sleep. Not really, because I went back to the bedroom and he started crying again. And at that point, I was just so tired because I had stayed up late doing homework. Um, and then just waking up every hour to come tell him he's okay. I was so exhausted at that point. I just got in the bed with him and I just laid in here and went to sleep in here. Where's Google? Um, so I slept in here with him and then this morning I woke up at like... I think it was like 7 and I went into bed Go. and then I think he woke up like 30 minutes later and then Scott came in here and got him because um, he started like whining again. Um, but I mean for his first night that's not bad. He slept for a good like solid few hours from when we, and he went to bed really really yeah. well. Um, honestly when I came in here to sleep with him I was had a hard time falling asleep because I'm not used to sleeping in this room like I kept hearing noises that I don't usually hear um, just like getting creeped out by like like the different environment in here like I don't know it's I think he did a better job than I did <laughs> um, it took it was hard for me to fall asleep um, so I think it, it'll be fine once he gets more comfortable with just being in this bedroom and taking his naps in here be careful <laughs> Um, but I think he did good for his first night all alone in his own bed. Like, I'm really impressed how well he went to sleep. No problem. Like, bye, night-night. Um, like, you can leave now. I was just like... And then I was in the, my, my bed, like, 
I want to go lay with him. <laughs> um, so he did really well. Um, bad news is this flat file is still here. I hate this thing. So all of these toys are going to be stored in like some kind of a storage system under the windows. Um, which we were going to do this weekend, but Scott tried to put all of his posters into these like cardboard things and he had some posters that didn't fit into it. So he has to wait until he gets bigger cardboards to store those posters to take this flat file out to the shed. So that means we're going to be living with this thing for probably another week or so. I want it out of here so bad. Like, this just gives me so much, like, anxiety and just, like, oh, it just, like, irritates me. Like, this mess. Like, I can't handle stuff not being, like, organized. And I can't organize this area because there's no room to organize anything. So his toys are just, like, all piled around it and on top of it. Um, well, this mess he just made <laughs> this morning. But, like, I just want everything organized and I can't because of this flat file. Um, and then I want to, like, we have, like, art on these two walls, which go together. And then this wall, it's, like, so random. Like, this, I hate this print, but it's Scott's poster. Um, that needs to go somewhere else. I, I started doing, like, a little gallery wall, and then he put this up, and it doesn't go with anything in this room. Um... But I don't know, I think I might take these things down and figure out something else with that because they don't really go either. Come here, what's the matter now? And then there's nothing on this wall. Um, so we need to figure out decor here. But I just don't want to do anything until we have the room, this out of the room and the room situated because this bed is going to go this way and not this way um but this is the only way that it fits right now because the flat file is in the way so i just want this room organized like it's really driving me crazy and then like he has all of his like other posters and frames over there that he needs to figure out what to do with and i'm just like oh just get all this stuff out of here oh, i just want it to look neat and organized and it's driving me crazy that i can't um Next week, I'm gonna work on my bedroom and start setting up the crib. I've already bought everything. I just need to set it all up and just really go through my clothes. I don't wear half of the clothes in there. Um, and I just haven't been putting my clothes away because I, I know next week I'm just gonna go through them. So, and I need to figure out a different layout for where to put my clothes. So my clothes have just been getting washed and folded and like piled up into a hamper basket or a laundry basket because I'm just like I'm just gonna take it out next week anyways so now my room's becoming a disaster so so yeah that's what's going on um anyways we're gonna go to party city or either party city dollar tree something like that um probably after Addison's nap because Scott's getting breakfast burritos we're gonna eat and then he'll probably have to take a nap soon um so after um his nap will go and we're going to start getting all the party supplies for his birthday because it's already in two weekends from now. So we need to start figuring that out. I think we're going to go to Costco during the week. We need to buy a couple more tables because we usually rent them. But we're just renting them for like a million times a year for all these different parties. So we just need to go buy two. Um, and then um, we need to find a place to buy chairs. And then I think we're just gonna rent a bounce house again and then just find like some like activities and stuff. Why is my, there's like so much static in my house right now. Like Addison's hair has been sticking up too. Like I don't know what is going on. Um, but I think we're just gonna do like some kind of like art and crafts and stuff for the kids. And then we're just gonna do like Costco, like sandwiches and um, pasta and then get pizzas and stuff. I'm like, it's just a kid's party. Like we don't need to be all extravagant. Um, but yeah that's what we're gonna do and then one of my girlfriends is gonna bake because she bakes really really good so she's gonna make cupcakes and i have my pinterest board of how i want to decorate for the finding dory theme um so we're gonna go get stuff today to get like streamers and all that stuff to do that so that should be fun and i've been talking for almost 13 minutes so i'm gonna stop now <laughs>
I know, baby. He's just he's whining a lot because he's hungry. He had breakfast when he woke up, but he usually has his snack or second breakfast around this time. And it takes forever for the to go get burritos at that place because there's always a huge line, and it's like probably like 5, 10, 15 minutes from here. So it usually takes Scott like 45 minutes to go get them and come back. <sighs> I'm gonna go deal with that and I need to finish editing my KonMari and deep cleaning of this bedroom that I did this weekend. What is the matter? Come here. Dory, you're calling Dory? Dory's in here. What do you need? What do you need? Can you come in here with mama? Come here, mama, play with you. some breaths in between the chewing. <laughs> Very good at eating a burrito now. <laughs> looks so cute. Big bites. Oh no, I'm good. <laughs> You can put it on your plate. Ready to go see Auntie Missy and Uncle Hunties? Looks like I'm ready to get out of this car seat. Good morning guys, it is Monday morning and we just had day two of sleeping in our big boy bed. He did so much better than the first night. Um, he only woke up once at like 3.30 and it was for like a second, like he was kind of like, oh, I, th I think it was more that he was cold than anything. So I put another blanket on him and he went right back to sleep. Um, and then um, he just woke up a little bit ago, so I am in here now in his bed because it is really cold and he is playing. Um, he did so good. <laughs> I look like I'm literally just like a big blanket. I need a Snuggie. <laughs> but last night we went over um, to Scott's aunt's house. She was having um, a little Super Bowl party, like super low key. Um, so we just went over there, um, watched the Super Bowl. Addison was so hyper, like, the entire time that we were there. Ooh, I'm tired still. Um, and we just, like, running around all over the place going, like, crazy. Um, and then we just came home, and um, I finished my homework, and Scott um, did his night routine. He did, had his bath. And, um, got ready for bed. Hey. Yeah, you. Huh? Oh, baby? No. You want a nana? <laughs> the phone's not going to give you a nana. You want mama to go get you a banana? Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, so that was it. So I just wanted to come end this vlog because I totally just, like, didn't really vlog yesterday much at all. I need to go get his banana because um, he just starts screaming when I don't follow after him right now. Mama, come get your banana. Um, but thanks for watching this weekend vlog. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.